So today we wrapped up all the dynamic events for this competition. We placed fifth in acceleration, 12th in skid pad, 22nd in autocross, and we finished endurance. Acceleration and skid pad went uh, very well. Our new driver, Abe Martinez, uh, was able to put down fast laps in both events um, on his first try, so he did very well. Uh, Fabrice Pacare did uh, exceptional as well. Today endurance went pretty well. Um, we knew we had some time to make up from our autocross performance, so we drove extra hard uh, right out of the gate. The car understeered a little bit, but for the most part, we were able to make up a lot of ground passing a lot of cars throughout the event. I drove second in endurance and uh, Bobby did an excellent job in putting 11 laps down nice and clean. I uh, got in the car with hot tires ready to go. Overall, the track was really great. Uh, lots of rubber got put down. I'm really happy with how fast the car is and look forward to driving again in Nebraska. With our next competition in Lincoln, Nebraska coming up, we need to be mindful of the weather there as it's very hot and um, uh, temperature of the engine is a big issue. So our, hopefully our dual radiators with the three cylinder engine will cool as well as it did here in Michigan. Yeah, Spartan Racing this year put together a really fast car as well as uh, a good cohesive team. So stay tuned and we'll be giving updates for Nebraska in a month. to what's most important, which is the awards. For the FEV Powertrain Award, third place goes to San Jose State. Woo! In sixth place, San Jose State University.